Yahweh Shalom. First and foremost, I'm going to give our praises to Yahweh, Ba'ashim, Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashim, Kakadash. Double honor to the elders of Prophet Ray Mills, on the time of the truth and the will. Peace, blessing, and salutation to Ike, my third, scattered brides and broad friends of the earth, that serving the truth and life, truth, and sincerity. To you, I say Shalom. Mr. Brothers and Father, coming to you with another video in the spirit. And this video is going to be about uh, E got you with the, uh, with the jab. Because now, um, I, I, I seen, I can't remember, was it an article or a video? Basically, basically getting those jabs was, uh, for no reason, you know? Like, you don't really, you don't really need it. Uh, I can't remember what it was that I, that I seen, but basically it went along to saying that, uh, you don't need the job, you know. Like it was pointless to get it, okay. And and he got people, and we was and we've been trying to tell you people, you know, not to get it. You know, we it's been uh stories that people who have taken it have died. It's been, it's, it's a story that came out people have taken it. Their illness, their uh, their health has gotten worse. You know, they uh they've been uh they you can. It's been uh, stories of people looking sicker and sicker and getting sicker and sicker. Like, their body is totally changed on them. And we've been trying to warn people, like, not not to, um, first off, not to trust E. Because when he first came out with the job, he was first targeting the, the niggas, Latinos, and Native Americans, which is the Israelites. So, we've been trying to tell you from the beginning that E knows who we are. You know, the, the higher ups, the elites of this world, they know who the Israelites are. And they understand and they and and they read they know the Bible. They read it. So they, they can see the prophecy that's coming to pass too. But what? What are they trying to do? They ultimately they're trying to what? Cut us off. Because they understand that the things that happen, they understand that they, they understand that their time is coming to an end and that we're gonna be the next in line of rulership. But they don't want that to happen. Okay? So they're, or they're, they're trying to cut us off. You know, they're trying to, they're, they're trying to, he's trying to take away, he's trying to stop us from receiving his birthright. But there's nothing he can do about it. You know, he gave it away. And that, and that's his fault. So, but you know, he, he's not going to go down without a fight. So if he, if he, he has that mindset, of, if I'm going down, I'm going to try to take as many as, as, as us down with them. But that's why the Lord is going to provide for us and the Lord is going to stand up for us and, and he's going to disappoint the devices of E to try to, uh, when he tries to perform his, uh, his crafty enterprise. So, um, uh, I'm going to grab this scripture. This is, uh, Sirach 12 and 10. It says, never trust thine enemy for like iron rusted so is his wickedness. It says, though he humble himself and go crouching, Yet take good heed and beware of him, and thou, and thou shalt be unto him as if thou has wiped, if thou has wiped a looking glass, and thou shalt know that his rust have not all been altogether wiped away. Con. So to help you get a better understanding, say if something rusted and you just like paint or piss or spray some coating over it, it looks good on the outside. But if you if you would if anything was to brush up against it, or if you was to wipe away that area that you uh, coated coated or or painted over, it would still be rusted. And that's E. You know, E is that is that same devil back then in the garden. You know, he he's never changed. You know, he's that same serpent who's trying to who's trying to devour Jake. Okay, so never and, and the scripture says never trust him. Never trust him. He never has your good intentions at heart. Never. Okay, that's why his whole his whole medical system is is for no reason. It's it's a money thing. It's all about money. It's not truly to help help people, especially you're not Jake. Okay, and I'm gonna grab this. This is a uh, Job thirteen and four. It says, but, but ye are forgers of lies, ye are all physicians of no value. Con. So they're a the forger of lies. Okay? So they're, they're not telling you the truth. So when this jab came out, they're not telling you exactly 
what's in it and they wouldn't tell you exactly the, the all the side effects of, of what was happening and what can happen and then people are so people are so stupid when when this job first came out uh they had to recall some of them uh i, I think it was johnson and johnson and um that was one more they had to recall some of these jobs because people were uh having re reactions to it and being fucked up but what <laughs> jake still first in line because what they want to believe what what he has to say they want to believe what the white man has to say other than believing your own people okay and that's and that's a problem with jake but they brought that on herself and the physicians and the physicians no value like they don't they man these doctors don't know shit plain and simple they don't know shit uh, i'm gonna grab this this is first peters five and eight it says be sober be vigilant because your adversary the devil as a run along lion walketh about seeking whom he may devour con and that's what he's trying to do he's trying to see who he can devour with this jab he's trying to see how many people he can affect and he and, and he can basically he can kill like the uh like the georgia godstones they're trying to he's trying to get the population under 500 million so he has different he has different ways that he's trying to do that and one of the ways he's trying to do that with this jab okay first he started off with the uh crown world 91 you know that that was knocking people off you know that's that's how he works he he creates a problem and it also has a solution for it which is not ultimately the solution it's it's just to catch you up more and more that's why the, the scripture says be sober be vigilant be vigilant be village uh be vigilant it's a lot here. and it's not talking about being sober like uh physically he's talking about spiritually being spiritually sober you know having the spiritual eyes to see right through this devil That's why in 2 Corinthians, it says, Lest Satan should get an advantage of us, for we are not ignorant of his devices. Con. And that's talking about the elect. We're not ignorant of his devices. We, we see right through E. And, and you can see now and now, E is becoming more sloppy. You know, he's not, he's not being on point with what he's trying to do. You know, he think he's being crafty, but he's not. He's being real sloppy. But Jake is so is so gullible and 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 just 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 stupid. Just stupid. They they're they're willing to 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 listen to the false narrative. You know, all he had to do was throw some numbers at Jake and 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 Jake hearts drop to their stomach. That's all they did. They didn't, and, and Jake don't do research, and he know they don't research. Even though we're in an information area, error, and you can easily look up anything that you want to look up and find it. Jake, he know Jake don't want to do that. He know that Jake likes a good story. So, you know, he 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 know how to get Jake. We're talking about a man who who searches out things, who who does his research. So that's why you have to do your own research as well and not let Satan get advantage of you. Um. <clears throat> because he's a liar. There's no truth in him. This is John 8 and 44. It says, ye are of the father, the devil, and the lust of your father, ye will do. He was a murderer from the beginning and of those not in the truth. Because there is no truth in him. Con, there's no truth in him. Nothing that he does or says is no truth in it. it like the scriptures say, his words be smoother than butter, but war be in his heart. It, and it all 24 7 what's on E's mind is how to he's how to get Jake. It's how to get the Israelites. That's all he's thinking about. That's all he's meditating about. They don't care about nothing else. They don't care about their own people. So they don't care about their own people. You know damn sure they don't care about Jake. 
It says, when he speaketh a lie, he speaketh of his own, for he is a liar and the father of a con. He's a father of, he's a father of lies. Okay? The father of storytelling. And what does Jake love? A good ass story. And that's what he did. He told, he put out there a great ass story. And what did Jake do? Ran right along with it. And now we're entering into the MOTB. Because and 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 now he's about to he's working on that agenda where he's gonna take cash out the way. He's he's it's, it's called it's called gradualism. He's he's slowly trying he's slowly but fastly trying to bring it to the to the forefront. But Jake not knowing no better is gonna fall right into the hands of it. That's why you need to stop bullshitting, Jake. Stop bullshitting. Because we're in serious times and playtime is fucking over. And this is not the time to be playing. All that partying and BS mentality is time out for all of that shit. We're talking about a man who's trying to who's trying to kill you. He doesn't have your best interest at heart. He's trying to kill you. And your how about Shimon Shah will allow that to happen if you don't take heed to him. He will allow that to happen to you. Okay, so be circumspect. Okay, see through the bullshit. Ask how about you try to open up your eyes because shit is getting real out here, and you don't want to get caught up in the things that's coming to this place. So that's pretty much it. Or Lord willing, this video was edifying. I'm gonna close out by giving all all praises to Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai by Hashem Rakadash Shalom.